ऐसे और वीडियोस के लिए मेरे चैनल को सब्सक्राइब करें थ्री टू वन स्टार्ट सर I am afraid I am not in a position to support the resolution which has been moved by my friend. I am not opposing this resolution because I am unmindful of the large number of abuses that exist in the corporate sector or I am less enthusiastic myself in saying that these abuses should be removed as early as possible. But the method that he has suggested is so the latter and the problem before us is so acute that no useful purpose will be served by appointing one more commission to investigate into the working of the corporate sector when we have got enough data and to my mind we have already got enough statutory powers to see that these abuses are checked and if possible completely eliminated I do not see what this commission can do whether it can throw more light on the malpractices that are rampant in the corporate sector we all know that any commission that deals with the particular problems of a particular industrial concern gives ample evidence of the fact that malpractices exist in the corporate sector and the government is aware of it I was one of the members of the joint select committee on the company law amendment bill 1998 which ultimately became the company law amendment act 2000 and in that committee also enough evidence was brought forward to show that malpractices existed in the corporate sector and certain salutary amendments in the company law were made in spite of these amendments and in spite of the original companies act we do find that abuses still persist and the question before us is how to deal with the abuses rather than investigate further into the nature of the abuses and the extent of the abuses to my mind the real remedy for us is not that of appointing commissions and committees and thereby postpone the solution of an urgent problem but to deal with the problem here and now with the agency which is at our disposal this agency is the department of company law administration which is working under the ministry of commerce and industry of the government of india this agency has again and again year after year in its reports complained that they have not got enough personnel to deal with the large responsibilities that have been placed on them